What's going on, boys and ghouls? I'm Chain Smoking Mike. Today has been quite an interesting day. You're probably asking yourself, why is today so interesting, Mike? Well, today's interesting because even though I may be an atheist, right, by, by nature, I'm starting to have doubts on this. Why, you might ask. Why is an atheist doubting their disdain and disbelief in a, in a higher power? Well, I'll tell you why. I went to a church um, earlier today, um, a Toga monastery. I went there to just visit it after a 20-year hiatus and to just appreciate some Russian history and culture. I went there with one of my Russian teachers. His name is Valery. And uh, Valery and I, we went there uh, earlier today around uh, 6 to 7 o'clock, roughly around 6 o'clock in the evening today. And we went there. And uh, there was a church service there. We went there and uh, paid our respects to Jesus Christ, God, and um, the saints. And the priest gave a um, like um, like um, like a cross sacrament on my um, on my forehead with, with some incense. So anyway, after this happened, every, the day went um, as normal. But this is the this is what was just fucking crazy, right? So when I was um, on my way home, I found some money, right? Literally just chilling on the ground. I was like, "The fuck is this?" And then I look closer, I'm like, holy shit, this is money. And I found literally a thousand rubles on the ground earlier today. I don't know what the fuck was going on, but I think either God or my late grandpa, um, a man named Leon Kornberg, a guy that I deeply miss and love with the bottom of my heart was... Uh, thinking about me and my financial struggles because uh, earlier today I was borderline broke and uh, when I saw this thousand ruble note I was like holy shit my my day went from like absolute dog shit to absolute like oh my god I'll be able to live decently for the rest of this week kind of level kind of shit and I don't know about you but if you believe in God, I think you would claim that God has been watching my back and observing my struggles and is making sure I'm in good hands. That or um, my grandpa was just watching my back and making sure I'm in good hands. Because when it comes to New Year's, New Year's um, Day, New Year's Eve is a pretty um, happy kind of event. And to not be able to afford something to, um, good to eat or just something good in general to do is a bad omen. And God, if there is a God, is making sure that he's watching my back and maybe just making sure that I'm having a good New Year's. Because in Russia, to do New Year's by yourself is very, very bad luck. And I have a friend... His name is Thomas. He's from Nigeria. Good man. Pretty uh, traditional kind of African-minded uh, guy. I respect him with all my heart. He's like a brother from another mother to me. And uh, if worse comes to worse, if he doesn't have any friends other than myself to hang out with, he is personally invited to visit my apartment and to spend a little time with me. Be it well, um, by drinking some good alcohol, be it like Jägermeister, to smoking a good cigar with me, to um, observe the upcoming New Year, and to basically give him my respect and best regards for the upcoming New Year of 2024. So there. Anyway, that's all I wanted to share um, about what happened today. It was just kind of eerie to me, even, uh, despite the fact that I'm a uh, hardcore atheist to the core. Um, I don't necessarily truly believe in God 
by, um, by default, but today has kind of fractured this hardcore belief in a sense because if there is a God, he's making sure that he's watching my back. Although, in a different reality, I really do think that my late grandfather, who passed away in 2019, noticed my struggles and wants to make sure that, I, that I'm in good hands financially. So, thank you, late Grandpa Leon. I love you. I miss you. And I hope that, in, that you are doing okay in heaven because that's where you belong. Thank you, Grandpa. Anyway, I'm going to finish the cigarette on my leisure. I just wanted to share something that interesting that happened to me today. You just watched something pretty eerie that happened. Almost occult-like, if you will. Anyway, I'm going to smoke this on my leisure. Just something kind of peculiar that happened to me. And take care and Merry Christmas um, wherever you are. Be it in Russia, in America, wherever. Have a happy Christmas. Even though I may not believe in Jesus Christ, I still wish you a very Merry Christmas. I'll catch you on the flip side.